Yes, guys, welcome back to the adventure. Today, we're back at the Starbucks drive-thru, which means we can only be in one place. We're at the Hawthorns for the Carabao Cup game between West Bromwich Albion and Arsenal. And what a tie that is. Honestly, I can't wait. Anyway, West Brom are flying in the championship. They're either second or third. Arsenal, well, less so in the Premier League. I think they're currently sitting at about 19th. They're winless all season. So, yeah, it's going to be an interesting tie at the Hawthorns tonight. So, yeah, time to head over. I'm running a bit behind, so I need to get inside as soon as possible. Let's go. Okay, seven minutes till kick off. I can give team news quickly. West Brom, completely different team. They're starting all their kids today, so I'm giving the young lads a run out. Love to see that. Okay, Arsenal, Aubameyang is back in, and he's captain in the side tonight. Avram Ramsdale makes his debut in goal, and Odegaard is making his second debut as he's now completed his permanent transfer to Arsenal. Saka starts, and Pepe. That's a bit of a lethal front three. Saka, Pepe, and Aubameyang. They're going for it, Arsenal. They need to win tonight. Oh, bless his heart. Snodgrass forgot to knee and take the kick off. Hey, we all make mistakes. Come on, let's go. Early warning signs up for West Brom. Martin Odegaard is making his second debut, finally completing his permanent move from Real Madrid to Arsenal. And the referees just fell over. <laughs> Early warning signs, Aubameyang got through, somehow managed to bring it down, took it to the byline. Uh, it went out, uh, but pulled it back. Pepe scored. That front three, Saka, Pepe and Aubameyang. West Brom need to be uh, a bit concerned. They need to get some throw-ins and get on the score sheet. So, uh, yeah, nil-nil. When they need him, there for the tapping. I mean, it's not the best goal they'll ever score, but he's up there with one of his most important, to be honest. Arsenal needed that goal for the season, not just in this game. So, uh, yeah, Aubameyang, he's top class in the E as well, class Aubameyang. 1-0 to Arsenal. Awesome. <laughs> Arsenal fans singing, we scored a goal and we're winning away. Lesser. I don't think it's that bad, is it? Arsenal fans, is it that bad? Oh! Oh! How's that not two? How good suck a Ballaret.
big, big call in this game. Right before half time on the 44th minute, he's there again. Pepe cuts inside, hits the inside of the post, and Aubameyang just in the right place at the right time for the second time today to score his second goal on his return to the Arsenal team. And boy, have they missed him. They've missed his goals, they've missed his presence as the captain. And uh, yeah, good goal that one. Again, before our time, how good is Saka and Aubameyang? This left hand side, so strong for Arsenal, and causing West Brom so many problems. Again, Aubameyang does the hard work, gets in, uh, good save by the goalkeeper, another tap in, this time it's Pepe, gets on his score sheet, 3 down. Okay, half time at the Hawthorns, and there always seems to be goals when I come to the stadium, and it is 3 0 to Arsenal at the break. And uh, I think the scoreline sort of sums up the half. I think Arsenal have been very, very good, uh, and they've been tormenting West Brom on this uh, on this left hand side. Saka and Abamiang, absolute causing chaos on this side. Keep getting through. Saka is having a field day, he is my man of the match so far. He's been fantastic to watch, and yeah, uh, Abamiang with the two goals, and Pepe with the one. All three of the rebounds, so uh, yeah, but you've got to be in the positions to score, don't you? Yeah, but yeah, the West Brom kids doing a very, very... Uh, the West Brom kids giving everything that they have, and they had a couple of chances in the early stages, but ever since then, Arsenal dominated the game. Uh, Erdegaard uh, has been fantastic in the midfield. Aaron Ramsdale's only had really one save to make, uh, but Arsenal on this left-hand side have been absolutely lethal, like I said. Yeah, simple as that. I think Arsenal deserves a 3-0 lead, and let's get into the second half, and uh, hopefully... Well, imagine if West Brom produced the comeback of the century. Well, they're going to need it tonight, but um, I think there's more goals in this for Arsenal. So this will be a big game to get their season going and hopefully take that form into the Premier League. And uh, bless the Arsenal fans singing, we're winning away. And uh, <laughs> I don't think it's that bad. I think you guys are still going to be up there, in, at least in the top eight this season. I don't think you guys are going down. So, yeah, don't worry about that one. And yeah, it's time to get into the second half at the Hawthorns. 3-0 at half time. Yeah, let's cross the second half. Saka's got his name on the score sheet and he's deserved that. Arsenal getting some goals tonight. 4 0, Saka. Aubameyang may have scored two top ins this game, but that one is well deserving of the hat trick. Three for Aubameyang, five for Arsenal, what a strike. He opened his body up, finessed it in the side of the net, stunning goal, 5-0. Wow, well, Aubameyang back to his best, they needed him and he's back. They should have scored six then at the top of the bar from a cheeky chip. Well, it's six now. Lacazette runs on to the end of a Pepe cross to finesse it into the bottom right. Another good goal by Arsenal. Six now, wow. I mean, when you play a Premier League side against West Bromwich Albion's kids, you need to get five, and Arsenal got six, many, maybe more, so yeah, they needed this to be honest, Arsenal. Ball 
full time at the home phone. Six of the best for Arsenal. Aubameyang grabs a hat trick. It's a perfect night if you're a gunner tonight. So that is going to bring an end to the vlog at the Hawthorns. Arsenal hit six against West Brom. Aubameyang hat trick and they were fantastic to watch, especially with Saka and Aubameyang on the left-hand side. If you have enjoyed the vlog, make sure to hit a like and subscribe down below if you want to join my adventure. And from the Hawthorns, peace out.